the problems that the world is facing in 21st century are some of the most complex and the most difficult we have ever seen. Solving those problems needs skilled minds that can create novel technologies that can span over different disciplines. All of the classes seem to have some sort of component where they're collaborating with business. Either they're getting a final project that's related to a local company, or maybe even the local companies have an actual problem that we're learning about methods to solve in the class and then our final project would be actually solving that. Computational engineering uh, and technical physics, it's not only math, physics and maybe IT. Uh, we talk here about uh, a combination, it's, you could think of it as a mindset, so you are being trained to analyze and understand and solve how complex systems work. And when you think of complex systems, that we can start from, from uh, in atomic level interactions in, in materials, we can go through to human body, how it works, how, how our health works, then you can move on to constructing buildings, uh, traffic networks are also complex systems, then we go to higher level climate and, and weather prediction and even space exploration. So computational engineers can, once trained properly, can solve and analyze and understand all those systems. All of the programs I've used here have been completely new to me, even though I spent four years studying computer science and math earlier. As a graduate of our program, you can be designing wind farms, for instance, or wind turbines for a wind farm. You can be an epidemiologist. You can be designing fast trains or maybe Formula One cars, or you can work on development of new materials that will take, take us to Mars they're trying to get you ready for industry instead of trying to get you theoretically smart or just trying to push you to a PhD program. They're really pushing you to get the skills you need to work in the private sector. We will teach you how to be curious. We will teach you how to ask more questions and then work on answering them. So there are no limits basically, the, the sky is the limit or maybe not even that.